Hi, I'm uh, Mike Catalano and uh, I'm here at the Precision Ag Conference uh, representing Geonics Limited. We're a manufacturer of electromagnetic induction instruments. Uh, many of the people in this industry uh, better know the equipment as soil conductivity meters. Uh, we measure the property of soil conductivity in a slightly different way than most people are used to in this industry. A lot of people are uh, familiar with direct uh, current measuring systems sim uh, similar to uh, uh, what the Varus uh, model uh, is and people are familiar with that. Uh, Geonics Limited has produced an electromagnetic induction uh, conductivity meters which measure soil conductivity through inductive methods for over 50 years now. So technologically this is something that's been done for a very long time. Uh, but uh, a little late coming into this market. Uh, as you can see, uh, this is a sensor that is most used in this particular industry. It's called an EM38 Mark II. Uh, and uh, it's designed and, and basic principles are based on the principles of electromagnetic induction, which are uh, there are transmitting coils and receiving coils in the unit. The transmitter produces an electromagnetic field which travels into the ground and induces current to flow. That current produces its own field and the strength of which that current is flowing is completely dependent on uh, the amount of clay or moisture in the soil or other properties such as salinity, um, compaction, uh, temperature as well and all those things change how strong that current flows but as strong as the current is you'll have either a stronger or weaker electromagnetic secondary field and that field is what's sensed at the surface by the device at the receiver coil end so the system requires no ground contact everything you need to measure conductivity is right here on this table the device weighs about four kilograms you don't require anything else other than maybe a sled uh, designed made out of non-metallic uh, systems and the reason we leave that up to the user or the customer is because we understand that no two fields have the same requirements for a sled you know uh, different conditions so the only now the sled is the easy part it has to be non-conductive made out of graphite or plastic wood um, but it can be towed and you can collect data on the fly uh, for soil conductivity uh, behind your vehicle the instrument uh, is composed of a transmitter on one end and then two receiver coils here and here. The transmitter produces an electromagnetic field which goes into the ground. That field induces current to flow. That secondary field is then picked up at either of these two receiver coils. So the electronics and, and all of the, um, the brains of the system are here. And all these knobs that you see are to allow you to zero and to calibrate the system prior to you using it. So you'd be like lifting it in the air, zeroing it to air, which is zero conductivity obviously. And then you put it on your sled or trailer or whatever you're doing to then tow and collect data with it. Um, that's really it, power source. You know, power source battery is there. You can connect a cable with an external, um, with external power to your vehicle or through a connector here. Um, but this, otherwise, the instrument is everything you see here. So sensor coils. There's three coils. They allow you to see down to a depth of, uh, you know, the reason for the different length coils is to change the depth that you're detecting to. So the one spread out one meter apart goes down a meter and a half. The one in the middle here, half meter apart you can see down three quarters of a meter. You can uh, visit our website at uh, www.geonics.com. Um, company once again is Geonics Limited. We make electromagnetic induction, soil conductivity meters. Um, if you have any questions, please uh, don't hesitate to e email us. Once again, my name is Mike Catalano. You can email me at mike at geonics, G-E-O-N-I-C-S dot com. This video is brought to you by Farms.com.